Right now, we're making patty melts. And we're not just making normal patty melts, we're taking these things to the whole next level. Let me show you exactly what ingredients I'm using to make this happen. I got mixed dry herb right there. I got a little bit of butter, caramelized onions, in and out secret sauce. In and out secret sauce, don't worry, I'm gonna put the ingredients and the measurements in the description below. The caramelized onions, if you don't know how to make caramelized onions, or you kinda of think you know how to make caramelized onions, or some guy showed you one time but you're still not sure, go check out my caramelized onion video and you'll definitely know how to make those. A couple slices of provolone cheese, we got two slices of sourdough bread, and of course our ground beef patty. Right, we got our nice hot pan. We're gonna drop in that burger patty and let that cook for about four to five minutes on each side so it's fully cooked all the way through. Four minutes, I'm gonna flip this guy over. Tilt your pan, flip towards you, always. Tilt the pan so the oil falls that way, flip the burger this way towards you. I already pre-seasoned my burger, FYI. So we already have salt pepper on there. Burger patty is done, so now we're gonna build this thing. Watch how we build this thing. Secret sauce, spread it on there liberally. Just like that. Two cheeses, I stepped it up. We're gonna put two on this and one on the other one because it's called a patty melt. So let's make it melty and cheesy. Gonna put the burger patty on top of there. Then you're gonna throw on these caramelized onions. Just like that. And our final piece of bread. We're going to place the sauce on top and the last piece of cheese. Don't miss this next step. This next step is my signature move. Check out what we do with this bread. Drop your butter into the pan. You're going to sprinkle those dry herbs inside of that butter. What's that doing? All that natural flavor from those herbs is now coming out from that butter. You're gonna place your bread right on top of that. And now all of that flavor is infusing into your bread. Not only are we getting that nice crispiness and buttery flavor, but now you're getting herb infused bread. We're gonna place the other piece on top we're gonna let this go on a medium to low heat because I wanna get that cheese nice and melted and get that nice golden brown on the bread before we flip this over. Same thing for this side. We got our butter in there melting down. We're gonna sprinkle our herbs. And then we're gonna flip this bad boy carefully right on top. Look at that beautiful color. I'm gonna push this down Get that butter soaking in that other piece of bread. And same thing here, nice, low and slow. Let all that cheese melt. And that, my friends, is how you make a patty melt sexy.